the previous system, we didn't have, you know, complete and uh, proper access that we needed, whether to create a program, edit a program if it wasn't working. Uh, we could, but it simply took probably a quarter or two quarters to get those things completed. We just didn't feel like that provided us with the level of service that we could get to our dealers. It didn't provide us the proper data that we needed to support our, our sales reps or our agents either. I think for us, we didn't have access to all the data that we needed, and we didn't have that in real time. It was always behind, maybe 30 or 45 days behind. That simply just wouldn't work for us. That was a challenge. You know, we couldn't solve problems quickly. Our team, they kind of always felt it frustrated. We felt handcuffed a lot of times. We want to give the dealer the best value. And with, for us, not having that, our loss ratio data in real time to where we needed to make changes to a product or a coverage or a price, I know in one particular manner, it got us in a spot where we had to do some type of price restructuring and that affected us in a negative way. I think if I had to, if I put it in one word to start, simplicity, and what kind of attracted it to us, uh, to us to this system was we looked at PCRS first, and then we kind of looked at all of the other options and systems that were available. And once we did that, then we absolutely knew that PCRS was going to work best for us. We looked at the systems and uh, other platforms, again, just to make sure we weren't missing anything due to the fact that, hey, this system does everything that we needed to do, really does it, it simplifies everything. You know, so maybe we weren't asking the right questions. We were looking at these other systems and platforms. When we re-looked at those, I mean, it was crystal clear for us that PCRS was the platform to, to go with. For us, I mean, I think it was easy. It was simple to the fact that how long did it take? 90 days, maybe 100 days at, at the most. And maybe we did it backwards, as crazy as it sounds. I mean, I kind of, I took it all and realistically built all the coverages, the plans, the products, and then kind of grabbed one of my team members from a specific department, and then we trained them on that specific department. So it, it was a lot faster than what I thought. When you, when you come up and do, you know, the two-day training, I believe what it was, uh, you leave with a lot of knowledge. It's helped us a lot with our, with our sales reps and our agents because they have that real-time data at their fingertips. Again, it's not 30 to 45 days late. They have that information current. As soon as a dealer does something, I mean, they can see it in real time on their end of the portal. That's been the biggest help, you know, for us to solve problems for, you know, for a dealership. We have, we have their data very quickly. As far as, you know, business, business-wise, it, it increased. I mean, I know that we increased our business 100% in the last 12 months. And a lot of it's due to the fact of using this system. One thing that we kind of pride ourselves on is listening to what our dealers want, you know, making a change to a coverage, making a change to a product, or even bundling a product or creating a new product. We're able to do that with the feedback that we can get back from the dealers, and we can translate that and put that in effect very, very quickly with this system. Something, you know, if, if I need to make a change or would have needed to make a change to uh, pricing, or coverage or a form, that would probably take 30 to 45 days to get completed in the platform that we used prior. You know, we do not have that challenge now, which is, it, that's a big positive for us. And if it's something that we look at and it makes sense, I mean, 24 hours, it's that fast. The system doesn't go down. Uh, we did experience that with the previous platform. If your system's down for a day, two, or even a week, it can cost you a lot of business. So we had experienced that. That's something we've yet to experience with PCRS. I don't anticipate that we will. For our dealers, it's a faster system. It's a simpler system. One of the big challenges that we had with the previous platform was the ability or 
how a dealership would pay for coverages and contracts that they generated. It was always a two or three step process, which they did not like, which translated into us waiting to get uh, paid for contracts. We get paid so much faster now with the one step payment process in PCRS. That's that's been a, a major, major help. We, we have several different uh, menu companies that we integrate with. You know, before we only had the option really to, as far as uh, DMS systems, was to integrate with uh, CDK Lightspeed. Now with the option to integrate with other different uh, menu vendors, you know, it allows us for power sports not only to integrate with CDK Lightspeed, but we can also integrate with DX1, which is by far the number two EMS provider in the industry that we're in, which is power sports. For me and one of the managers, it frees us up to be more supportive to our reps and our agents that are out in the field that are boots on the ground instead of us. It's taken a lot of the work away from the administrative sides, which is good because it's all it's it's just so simple. I don't I don't have another 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 way to explain how simple the, the process is from contracting to claims to receivables and payables. It's it just freed us up to where we can do what we need to do, and let's go out and get more business. I would say look at PCRS. Be open-minded. Make the switch. It's pretty simple. Do a demo. Do it twice. Compile your questions. Just make the switch. I think when I look back at the timeline, if we could have, you know, made the, would have, we could have, we just didn't, you know, pull the trigger and make the switch, you know, nine, 10 months sooner. I wish we would have done that, you know, could have, should have, would have, I guess, one of those situations. But, you know, we did, I can't imagine that we would have had the growth that we, that we had in the last 12 to 15 months if we had not made that switch to PCRS.